Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to join a Zoom meeting. So if someone else invited you to join a Zoom meeting, this is the right video for you. If you wanna host your own meeting and learn all about Zoom, I have a different longer video in the description below this video so you can watch that. Now, Zoom is an app for your computer and for your phone. So on a Mac or PC, you do have to install the Zoom application before you could join the meeting. But the process is very straightforward. I'm gonna use this computer to host a Zoom meeting and then I'll use this laptop here to join that meeting with a different account. So I'll pretend to be two different people. One is creating the meeting, the other one is joining the meeting. Let's jump in here. So in order to join a Zoom meeting, you need a couple of things. You need the Zoom app and you need the meeting ID and password. Those things are required for anybody to join an existing meeting. So I typically, when I create a meeting, send an email to people so they have that information. So this is the email I got from the person that created the meeting. So it will have a link to Zoom to join and download Zoom, and it will have the meeting ID and password, the numbers I'm required to type in when I actually try to join. I could also skip all that and join with a phone number and a password to that conference room. This won't allow me to do video chats and use the Zoom app really, but I could listen in if I want to. So those are the dial-in numbers here. You could do it this way. I'm not gonna show you that, that's pretty straightforward. I'm gonna show you the Zoom meeting, downloading the application to your computer, and then adding your meeting ID and password. So click this link here. If you don't have this email, you could go to zoom.us and download Zoom there. So if you don't have this link here, you could either click the description below this video to get it, or you could go to zoom.us. So I'll click it here, and this brings you to zoom.us. It recognizes your computer and downloads that version, so in this case for a Mac, to my computer. So I'll go ahead over here and press that to install that application, the Zoom application on my computer. And this is the Zoom application here. Now, if you want to create your own meeting, you have to sign in, watch the other video, but I'll go ahead and press join a meeting. And this is the number I mentioned, the meeting ID. Let me go back to that email. This is the meeting ID over here. I'll go ahead and copy this over here. So I'll go to edit, copy. I'll bring it back to my Zoom app and I'll go ahead and edit, paste. That's my meeting ID. My name, that's just what other people are gonna see. So type in the name you want other people to see. I'm not gonna connect audio and video. I'm gonna turn those on once I join the meeting so I know what they look like. I'll go ahead and press join now. Now it's gonna ask me for the password. Again, that's right here on the email. Go ahead and copy that, bring that here and paste that. So now you can finally join that meeting. Let me go ahead and minimize this email now. And this big window is the other person that invited you. So right now that video is off, but that's what you're seeing over here. My little window is up here. So if I want people to see me, I'll have to start video. That's why I usually turn it off because then I could turn it on whenever I want to. So I'll go ahead and turn that on by pressing start video. And now they could see me right on here and I could go ahead and press join audio. I'll press that and it's gonna ask me if I wanna test my speaker and microphone. These are some of the things you must do to make sure everything's working and if I like everything, I'm gonna say join with computer audio. I usually recommend buying an external mic like the one you see here. It's gonna make the audio quality a lot better if you're using this for more professional purposes and that's just the USB mic that connects to your computer. So I'm gonna go ahead and mute this here. And just I'll show you briefly a couple of things here, but you could invite other people by just pressing invite. That'll give you the meeting password and the meeting ID if you copy the URL, or you could send the email that I just showed you in the previous email if you were to invite other people here. You could see the number of participants. It'd be over here. It shows you the host and it will show you yourself. You could go ahead and share your screen. You could go ahead and chat. The chat window's down here where everybody could see what you're saying or you could limit that to just the host. You could go ahead and record this conversation and you could add reactions here to the meeting right here. It will show up right here. But if you want a bigger general overview of Zoom, watch the full tutorial on that. Anytime you wanna leave the meeting, press leave meeting right here and then you could go ahead and press leave meeting. The meeting will continue without you, but you're no longer in the meeting and the computer has turned off the video and audio sharing. And that's all it takes to join a Zoom meeting. Again, watch the full tutorial to see all the things that Zoom has to offer, including creating your own meeting. And I hope to catch you next time. Thanks so much for watching this video.